Hi Spy fans, it's your friendly neighbourhood thoughts. I'm a Spider-Man fan here. And um I'm back with another video on me reading my Marvel Spider-Man PS4 hostile takeover book. And as you can tell, I'm showing you some gameplay as well. So yeah, this is the new style, it's not the comic book style, it's the gameplay style. So, let's get right into this. So um I don't think you'll see the introduction, so well if you do, you do, but uh I'll just say this. Um you spy fans already know what to do, so um for those of you who don't Make sure to like, subscribe, comment, ask me any questions, hit the bell, and uh, I can't type it up on the screen here, but follow me on Twitter as well. Type in the ass and all capitals without spaces, the ultimate spy, that's PID. And uh, yeah, let's get right into this. Woo! Right, chapter four. Chapter four, right. She, she was a slender woman in her thirties, wearing jeans, a leather jacket, and a yellow button-down shirt. She looked like she meant business, though she didn't seem terribly eager to shoot him. Spider-Man relaxed a little. What, what, are you do what are you doing here? She demanded of him. I didn't kill him, he answered. As soon as he did, it sounded lame. <laughs> I know that. She. I know that, she snapped. Sorry, Spy fans, I'm trying to do the emotion as well. Unless you figure out how to hide a pistol in that, in that skin-tight suit of yours, I'd stick, I'd stick out like a... It'd stick, like, I'd stick out like a tumor. Thanks, he offered. Don't be funny, tell me what you know. Any chance you could put that gun down? The woman glared at him then, sighed. <sighs> I don't suppose it would do much good against you anyhow. She, she holster her weapon. She, you just grabbed it with those rope thingies of yours? They're actually webs, Spider-Man said, powered by science. Anyhow, let's do the let's do this to play. Why I'm Spider-Man and you are L Lieutenant Yuri Watnabe, she said in a clipped voice, and I'm not looking for a new pal. You're a person of Ent interest in a murder investigation, and while bringing you to the precinct for questioning would present some challenges, putting out an APB on you would probably mess up your week, so how about you stop wasting my time? No nonsense, talk tough as nails and willing to work with Spider-Man, he liked that, and it made him think. For years he, he wondered how much more he could get done if he had a direct relationship with the police department. His mind raced, raced with the possibilities. The trick would be to prove his his worth to her. That that would involve a much lower percentage of wisecracks per sentence than what, what came naturally. Yeah, naturally. But he was pretty sure if he focused he could get it done. Tell me how I can help," he said. "Why did your voice change so ch suddenly? Get so deep? It didn't. It did, and it still is. Before you sound like a kid. <laughs> hey! I know you sound like a kid trying to fool someone over the phone. How about less criticism and more crime solving?" He proposed. A worried little smile flickered across L Lieutenant Watanabe's lips. Then she was back to business. You see that trailer down there? She pointed to a white metal rectangle about 200 feet past where the other plainclothes cop, cop was still sipping his coffee. He was also looking at, the, at his phone and was and from the distance Peter couldn't be sure but it looked like he was playing some kind of jewelry matching game. <laughs> That's the terminal security officer said. The door's on the far side so if you can meet me there without anyone seeing you, I'd like to show you something. Give me five minutes. Then she was gone. G getting to the entrance was no problem. A little creative swinging and he was through the door. L Lieutenant Watanabe was was seated at a desk running her fingers along a keypad. It was gloomy, uh, gloomy, but a half dozen video monitors uh, illuminated her face, each showing a different section of the facility. The, the trailer smelled like an old gym smelled of, of old gym clothes. What, what Nabi turned the moment <coughs> she me turned the moment he entered and her hand moved to, uh, moved towards her gun, not quite touching it. She might be willing to work with him, she might even trust him on principle. But she wasn't about to let her guard down. Peter didn't like her any less of it. It was common sense. I told everyone I needed to concentrate in here so we have a few months. She began with I any preamble but we don't have the, all the time in the world to save your comments and questions so save your comments and questions for the end her fingers danced across the keyboard one of the one of the monitors went dark and then began playing a playing a recording the first thing she showed him was a black and white black and white clip revealing his first encounter with Andy a time signature spun 
r rapidly in the lower left corner. It was always it was always weird watching footage of himself. There was a part of his mind that never quite got used to seeing himself from the outside. When when I left, he was fine. Spiderman said the footage backed him up. Quiet, she said, for forwarding the footage for what looked like only a few minutes. It showed Andy walking away from the dock, trying to keep the shadows, probably mindful of the security cameras. Then Spiderman le leapt in behind him, landing lightly on his feet, so lightly that so lightly that Andy seemed not to notice. Definitely not how things happened. He knew that move, knew how to land from thirty or forty feet up without making a noise. He did it all the time to get a drop on the bad guys and had taken him also to, to learn the trick back when he was first started out. Now it was second nature. The problem was that wasn't him, was it? The moves were right so much so he had to remind himself that it was impossible. He looked at the time signature. By that time he was well on his way to the construction site. Holy crap, this has to be the guy. The imposter. He was about to open his mouth to say something when Spider-Man imposter raised his right hand. He, he held the gun. He looked at Absurd and strange and Grotsky. I, I don't know what that word says. Grotsky. Spiderman never touched the gun unless it was to get away from somebody who had one. Even then, he, he usually used his webs. Guns were big and, big and loud and nasty. They were difficult to announce and frequently, frequently dead. They were, they were everything he didn't want to be. The, the, the imposter must have said something because Andy jumped. His shoulders lurching upward and his legs wet, wa wobbling in middle in, in mid skid S mid strid. He turned and then started to back back paddle. There was the burst of mu uh, muzzle flash, a violent eruption of light that absorbed everything else in the dark frame. When the light cleared and they lay on the ground, the imposter took him took a moment to examine the body. Then he fired three more shots into. The prone figure he paused for another instant and then shifted his gaze to look at the security camera. At least it seemed like he did. It was hard to tell with the mask. He then raised his left hand a web shot out and he propelled himself out of the camera's field of view. Spiderman needed time to gather his thoughts. There were, there were a hundred There were a hundred things he wanted to say, but he didn't even know yet what half of them might be ideas burst into his mind only to be replaced by others outrage pity and and indign indignation raw emotions had the advantage here but there were other things Ob observe observations of minor details that some distant ca calmer part of his mind knew might be of use to the detective it, it was hard to stick to logic though and he had Died facing an imposter. He he died believing that Spiderman. Uh, he died believing that Spiderman had gunned him down. It didn't make the crime any worse, and, and it made him all the more determined to do something about it. I didn't do that. He said I would never do anything like that. It's an, it's inconsistent. It, it it's inconsistent with your past behaviour. What Navi replied in a cl clinical tone, and it would be hard to prove that the one person wearing a mask is the same as another person wearing the same mask. The perp moves a, a whole lot like you do, though, and that's harder to mimic. If you, ha if you have an alibi, it would help us. Maybe there's another place you might be on camera at the same time, though, again, we still have the mask and ident identity problem. First of all, that's not me. His, his thoughts began to shift into focus, at least some of them. I don't use guns, and I absolutely don't go around assassinating people, even the Daily Bugle, back when Jameson was call calling from my head never claimed I would do that. I believe you, but Nabi said we playing the footage, but my opinion doesn't count as evidence. Spiderman leaned in closer to the screen, peering at the costume figure who appeared there. Freeze it, he said. There, the suit isn't quite right. It's close, it's a, it's a decent copy, definitely better than something you'd get from a costume shop. But the the, the the design is a little is a little off. I can't say anything about the colour, but the spire icon doesn't look exactly like mine, and the web lines are too close together. I noticed that too, too Lieutenant Watnabi said. Here, look at look at the earlier footage. She she brought it up on another screen. You would have had to change your outfit into something nearly identical. identical. Uh, sorry, Spike, I lost the answer. And then come right back. It doesn't make sense, but when, but when, whenever we're dealing with costume f vigilantes, making sense doesn't always apply, she left. 
her voice trail off in a way that in indicated she was playing devil's uh, adv advocate and now he's actually arguing a position she believed. Spiderman took a deep breath, deep breath organizing his thoughts. He needed to tell her everything that had happened and had to figure out what would what would be most useful. She pulled she pulled out herself while he began describing his encounter with Andy. Getting the tip about the construction site, and he went through everything that happened there as well. It sounded awfully conf confident. She said tonelessly as she typed, A guy who can copy your moves just happens to show up. The same nice spider man as Philomene. It, it, a guy who can copy shows up, and the same nice spider man as Philom ki killing a kid. She shook her head like I said, Things with your crowd don't, don't always make sense, but this feels like a setup. The, the disposable henchmen were, were there to slow you down, while the real bad guy changed his clothes and highlighted it over there to face you. I'm um, sorry. Yeah, highlighted it uh, over there to face you. And uh, it sounded p p p uh, possible, but there were still a lot of unanswered questions. Why change his clothes at all? Maybe because he wa wanted you to see this? She said with a shrug, probably figu figured. Uh, figured You'd catch it on the news rather than here with a cop, but I think the the shooter made wanted this video to be a, a gut punch. Someone is calling you. I I'd ask if you have any any enemies, but that's a stupid question. If the construction site has video cameras, and most of them do, then it will at least prove that that part of my story. I'm thinking the same thing. She said, "You, you got an, you got an address." He told her about the building, and Lieutenant Watton Abbey's eyes went wide. She sat down, her phone turned to look at him. Are you kidding me? You're sure that's the location? Yeah, why? She let out a long breath that hissed between clenched teeth. It's hidden behind hundreds of pages of documents and a half a dozen shell companies, but that construction site is owned by Wilson Fisk. She worked her mouth as she was trying to get rid of a bad taste. The, the frigging kingpin of crime. And that's it. Chapter 5 coming next, Spidey fan. Spidey fan, sorry. Spidey fans. So, yeah. That's it for this one. So, yeah, ho well, hope you're enjoying the story so far. For those of you who don't have it out there. And, yeah, I hope you enjoyed this gameplay. Well, the back. I, like, I hope you enjoyed this new style. I've got more in the way. I'm making them. But, uh, yeah, hold on that. Thanks for watching. And stay tuned for all of my next Epic Spidey videos, broadcast, gameplays, and... Um, my next reading video as well and possibly my next news video as well as I've started doing them as you would have seen in my last announcement video so yeah holla that it's your friendly neighbourhood the ultimate spidey fan over and out the wet